Hi, welcome to Mathademics. Today we're going to be working on partial sums addition in third grade. Partial sums addition is going to help you to add numbers in the hundreds. My first problem is 357 plus 231. My first step is that I divide my problem into hundreds, tens, and ones. I'm going to add 3 plus 2. I'm going to add 5. But it's not just 5, it's 500. Next, I'm going to move on to my tens. 5 plus 3, 5 plus 3, 5, 6, 7, 8. I'm going to put 8 in the tens, but it's not just 8, it's 80. Then my ones column, I'm going to add 7 plus 1. And 7 plus 1 is just 8. Now all I have to do is put a plus, and I'm going to add up my numbers. 0 plus 0 plus 8 is 8. 0 plus 8 in the tens column is also 8. I bring down my 5. I know that my answer is 588. 357 plus 231 gives me 588. I'm going to show you how to do the second problem, which is on the right side of our screen. 328 plus 264. The first step is to divide our problem into hundreds column, tens column, and the ones column. I start by moving from the left to the right. My hundreds column, I have 3 plus 2. 3 plus 2 is 5, but it's not just 5, it's 500. Next, I'm going to add 2 plus 6, and 2 plus 6 is 8. But I need to remember my 0. Finally, 8 plus 4 is 12. I'm not going to put all of my information in my 1's column. I'm going to split it between the 10 and the 1's. I add it all up. 0 plus 0 plus 2 is 2. 0 plus 8 is 8. And 8 plus 1 is 9. Finally, I bring down my 5. 328 plus 264 is 592. Thanks for joining us today on our partial sums addition problem. If you have any more questions, please see your teacher. Can we see 